seems to have paid off, but we've endangered the lives of everyone involved to satisfy the doctor's curiosity. The risk was worth the reward. If we hadn't pushed on, there's no way we would have gotten this information. Pursuit. Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. The UFO came down in a sparsely populated area away from any major population centers. We can secure the site with limited danger to the civilians in the area. They've been protecting this ship with their most advanced technology. So it's safe to assume whatever they've gotten there is crucial to their invasion effort. We should expect heavy resistance. They're not going to make this easy on us. Understood. Moving out. I'm going as fast as I can. Moving. Affirmative. Ignition. I'm on it, Commander. to that location.
Shot wide! to that location. Moving to position. Ghosting. Heading out. away. That's 
what you want. It's still there. Turn him down. On the move. about this and I do. Heading to that location. We've got eyes on the AO. That's affirmative. I'm on my way. Target locked. There's something here. I do owe you that much. Oh, I missed! Aye, aye, Commander. I'll get him next time. Moving out. I'm already on my way. Double time. Position confirmed. I 
understand. If the aliens have reserved this cloaking technology specifically to hide this ship, we can only assume it is carrying something extremely valuable. Or oh, very dangerous. Travel out! I don't miss the ledge. to reload. Fallen ass. I am reloading. Okay, okay, I'm going. I'm rolling. Cutting ignition. Will do. It's killing time. what you want.
on your order. Headed there now. Moving in for the kill. you wish. Reloading. You're the boss. I'm rolling. I don't think we are alone out here. This is unlike anything else we've previously identified. Based on its physical appearance, I would assume this alien doesn't rely on brute strength. I recommend the troops exercise extreme caution, Commander. I think I liked it better when the weapons were obvious. Commander, that device, it seems to be of great importance to them. Retrieving it for further study should be our highest priority. Will I get to kill aliens over there?
Grenade! This works. Target stunned. Ride the lightning. successful operation. from a cloaked ship and guarded by the most powerful being we've ever encountered. What do you think it is? An object of immense power. Think of all we could do if we unlocked its secrets. A dangerous sentiment, Doctor. Sir, I'm picking something up. Another cloaked ship? No, sir. It's big. Tell me that was a coincidence. Wish I could, sir. That seismic event originated directly beneath our new contact. Nothing we have would even make a dent in that thing. If you two have any more bright ideas, now's the time. Your men certainly seem to have a knack for capturing alien subjects alive. I only hope they realize how important their work is in relation to ours. Please, pass on my gratitude to our forces.
We may have finally found the purpose behind Annette's captivity, and the results are disturbing to say the least. It appears that Annette and the other unique captives are capable of amplifying the psionic abilities of others, allowing the aliens to exert mental control over a number of victims simultaneously. Unfortunately, in using Annette to attack XCOM, the resulting stress caused significant trauma to her neural tissue. She will never have this specific ability again, although she may still retain psionic aptitude. Coming down to the wire here. Now that we've backed the aliens into a corner, I think we'll see what they're really made of. Personally, I expect nothing short of pure desperation in their resistance. They've invested too much to go down without a fight. appears to be at the top of the alien hierarchy, and for good reason. As you've probably seen, its physical form is not suited for combat by any means. However, these elders have an incredible pool of psionic energy at their disposal, which helps to explain why the other species are subordinate to them. 